Um, but the corporate office, which is a very lovely facility, is out on the west end, and that's where you know we've got. That's all corporate people, and okay. again, um, you know, several okay. hundred people that work there, as well as the State Farm Regional Headquarters. Uh, they're next to each other. So, you know, we've got some stable, and, and those guys were here during the worst of times. Okay. Uh, our unemployment figures tend to run higher than sometimes you would think okay. with all the stuff that's going on. But I think we, you know, it's, it's with, with everywhere. You don't, you have jobs, but the people that are looking for them are not necessarily trained or educated in that specific area. Okay. We've had several call centers come in just within the last year okay. um, that are um, employing a, a lot of people. Not not high end wage, but I understand. Um, they, does Loprino's pay well? I would imagine it does. Loprino is for a manufacturing plant. It's, it's a it's it's a good. And how about JBS? Is it, are those, are those yeah, good you know, wages out there in the plant? The, the plant isn't, I don't know, somebody told me they start them at fourteen fifty or something an hour, mm -hmm. which is not horrible no. you know, when you're looking at the manufacturing end. Unfortunately, or fortunately, you look at it both ways, that's where the majority of our immigrant population is working. Sure. Um, because it is not necessarily because of the wage, just because of the nature of the work. Sure, you bet. It's not as is it attractive no. for most people. No, it's a basically a big slaughterhouse. It'd be a call center, and then, and it is a big slaughterhouse. Um, so, uh, 